What's going on, everybody? Andrew and Sarah here of So Thrift and So Cream. There's that famous wave again. I said I wave right. every time, right. but I'm going to keep doing it. So today we have a little bit of a, a surprise. I had a little bit of a surprise trip to the Goodwill bins. Was not necessarily planned, but got home and figured why not give it a shot. Now, as we've mentioned before, um, Sarah has been taking a break from the bins, so mm -hmm. I went solo. So For the first time. For the first time. <laughs> so tune in to see how it went. All right, y'all, I am headed to the bins by myself for the first time. So we're gonna see how I do today. It was kind of a last minute decision to go. As you guys know, Sarah is very pregnant, had a hard time going to the bins, so she has put that on hold right now, but we need inventory, so I stepped up. I stepped up and I am going solo. So. Um, stay tuned. We'll see how I do today. Actually, at the bins. Got to be honest, I'm a little nervous. Um, you know, first time venturing out on my own. Um, so, you know, it's game time. And uh, what if I don't perform? Um, but, yay, yeah, we'll find out. I'm getting ready to head in. I will keep you posted. All right, y'all. So I just got done at the bins. I was there for two hours. Um, I'll be honest, when I first got there, I was a little bit discouraged, which uh, doesn't happen to me often. You know, I try not to let myself get down, but I walked in and they, there was no clothes. It was all hard goods. Like every bin was hard goods and there was maybe three or fourth clothes. So drop a comment if you've seen this before, if maybe there's a day of the week that they typically do this or a day of the month or whatever it is. Um, but yeah, I walked in and every bin was hard goods and there was a couple on the perimeter with some clothes. Um, a couple, some shoes mixed in with the hard goods, but just not a lot. So wasn't finding much at first, um, was kind of just putting some things in my cart, um, just cause I couldn't go back empty handed. Um, you know, I, I, uh, definitely, uh, you know, it's, a, it's a quite a trip up here. It takes about an hour to get to the bins from where we live. Um, if I came back empty handed, Sarah might make me sleep on the couch. So I couldn't have that happen. So start throwing things in the cart, um, checking some comps, things like that. And then they start bringing out some new bins and there was more and more clothes. And then I just went to work. Um, I think I ended up with like 56 pounds. So got a trunk full, going to go home, go through it, show Sarah, see, uh, see if she's surprised, if I did good, if she thinks I could have done better. We'll see. But I think overall I did all right. Like I got, I got some good items. So there's some stuff that I threw in that I was going to check comps and just stuff got piled on top of it and never got around to it. Forgot all that good stuff. But, uh, I, I started to kind of catch my groove after they started bringing out those new bins. So, uh, we'll get home. We'll see how much we got, but, uh, overall I think pretty good haul. Where's the goods? Out of the car. Why didn't you bring them in? Well, because I got too much stuff to carry. Oh, how many bags? I mean, more than you thought I'd need. Yeah. <laughs> Poor Cindy, what are you doing? Are you having fun? It's by almost nap time. Yeah, I scored. <laughs> all right, so we're back. I am now well fed, showered, all cleaned up from the bins. Um, and it's time to go through everything. So. For starters, I just want to note, when I left, <laughs> I grabbed four bags, and Sarah goes, oh, a little ambitious, are we? I didn't say you no. You said it exactly like that. I was like, like wow, a, four bags. I, I usually take two. I don't see any difference. No, okay. Anyway, you only take two? That's not true. Well, I take two, but they're like, I usually regret it, because they're overflowing. Oh, yeah, so, so prepare, see? You yeah. gotta prepare. Okay. You prepare. okay. So I took four bags, filled every single one of them, even have one item outside of a bag, so I mean... Needless to say, you need I did my box. job. Yeah. I did my job and I got some items. Now, I don't know if they're the best items. The one rule during this video is that you cannot make fun of me <laughs> if I pick something up that I shouldn't have or that is not worth anything. Does that go for me too? What do you mean? I can't make fun of you? Well, I was mostly talking to you. Oh, okay. <laughs> um, but anyway, um, and then before we get started, also... I uh, just want to give a shout out to the Fi resellers. Um, we've gotten some comments on our YouTube videos lately that some of you have been sent from them. So thank you so much um, for tuning in. And if you aren't following them, look them up on Instagram. They're an awesome couple of resellers, um, a lot of good information. So yeah. um, again, thank you guys. So we'll dive into it. Oh man. Have I'm we already there. said, I haven't seen any of this. Yeah, Sarah. Well, I, You've seen like I, I told you a couple a of things. A couple things. But nothing like like they're out of all the items. Everything I'm looking at right now I haven't seen. <laughs> so the first time I'm gonna grab, I meant to go back and look up. 
Okay. To see if it was worth anything. Okay. It might be worth absolutely nothing. But it's it a little, looks cool. uh, I don't know, what do they call it? Is that called a romper? Or what like a that? jumpsuit. A jumpsuit. The brand is Lily Blue. Yeah, it's got some oh, see, that thing I, damage. I didn't, well, I didn't, I was going to go That's back okay. and look at this one. Um, I, have to, I don't know that brand. Oh, well, so I would have had to look it up too. Yeah. Let me see. Let me show the tag. Maybe, maybe this is well known and Lily Blue. Maybe I have seen this. No, I don't know. Have you guys seen this tag, I don't know if you can see now, it. Again, there's a lot of items in here too that I was gonna go look up, but then things got kind of crazy, and then yeah. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. So it's a super cute like jumper. There's just a tiny bit of damage, yeah. but I think we can sell it. I'm still gonna list it. I think it's cute. Yeah, yeah that's cute. That's cute. cute. <laughs> so these, I know the brand got some silver jeans. Yeah. And those are those are good, right? Yep. Like silver's I've picked good. up silvers. You picked up silvers. Everything looks good in them. A little bit of stretching, but overall, like, yeah, decent. I would, I would have probably picked those up. They're a good size. They're the Sukis, which I've sold the exact one before. Um, yeah, I would have picked those up. All right. So far, so good. So far, so good. So this one, I remember specifically. I looked some stuff up. Couldn't find a whole lot, but it's like super, super light. Like the material, like I. Feel like some of the stuff it's like when you're at the bins this had to have cost pennies so yeah. um prescott new york it's a button up um some of the stuff i looked up like i couldn't find like everything was kind of all over the place on it i uh, so it looks kind of so it's a 3x so that's awesome because i love selling plus size um i off the top of my head i don't know so um We'll have to see, but it's a cute shirt, and it's 97% uh, rayon. Oh, that's another thing. I see. I, I looked at what they were made <laughs> out of, and I remember you saying rayon was better. I mean, I feel like it's a good indicator that it's, like, a better brand, yeah. typically. Um, it's not, like, polyester or anything like yeah. that, and it's a nice it's a nice top. I like it's that. nice top. All right, I got some cut from the cloth. Bermuda shorts. Bermuda shorts. That's what I was going to say, Bermuda yeah. shorts. Just your standard pair of Bermuda shorts. I would have picked those up. Yeah, you would have picked them up. Yeah, cut from the cloth. I feel like it's kind of hit or miss, but we sell it and oh, we're going into short this. season. I was, so I was, I was a little excited about this one. Ooh. What do you think it is? Guesses on brand. Okay. Guesses guesses on brand. I really, I, I, I didn't look, but I really want to say like Lululemon or Free People because, nope. but I feel like nope. you would have told me nope. that you found Lululemon. I don't know. It's Zara. Oh, look at you. Ooh, right, I see. <laughs> That's a Zara top. That's cute. Yeah. yeah. Wow. Um, Looks like you're going to the bins more often. Oh, this I wasn't sure. It was like pretty much brand new. Like it feels like it's pretty much brand new. It's a Christopher and Banks sweater. Another one that I was like not sure on. But also I mentioned this before on my way to the bins or when I got done at the bins. But today was weird. Like when I first got there there being nothing but hard goods so like i was kind yeah. of panicking at first so i was like kind of throwing some stuff in the cart <laughs> and this i think nervous. was one of them and i wasn't sure about it and then like then things kind of started like getting piled on and um i just never No, i that. like that I, I we've sold christopher and banks yeah. before i don't think it's like a super high-end brand or anything but it's um i think it'll sell and it's a nice like you said brand new so this is lush that box we got did it have like some lush stuff yeah, we've sold Lush. And um, it's, like, super light. Like, again, probably cost pennies because of how, like, yeah. light it is. So I figured, why take the time? Time is money. Pick it up and go. <laughs> oh so, yeah, Lush we've sold before. Um, I don't think it, it's... I don't... I'm not sure the specifics on the brand, but... Um, yeah, that's nice. This is a Banana Republic quarter zip. I don't know if you picked Banana Republic up ever, but... I Sometimes. Just, it felt like it was in pretty good condition. It was another one where it's kind of like a grab and go and meant to go back to. And, it, and not all of them are like that, I promise. Is this, just, like, it, this, is probably, this is probably like the bag. spot in the cart that this stuff was. Yeah. Because this is, yeah, this is the, well, no, I don't, I just randomly threw them in the bag, but from the cart. Yeah. I didn't take the bags in. Oh, that's okay. Um, I think it's a men's, but yeah, that's, I, I might've picked that up. I pick up Banana Republic sometimes. Yeah, so. Yeah, and also I've heard some people say recently actually that they don't like when they go to the bins. They don't like looking at the stuff with tags on it. Why? Because they think if it didn't sell at the Goodwill, they don't really want it. But our Goodwills in Oregon are way overpriced. Oh, way overpriced. So stuff that didn't sell at the bins or at the stores 
probably is at the bins because it was overpriced. So I always like look at stuff with tags and I can kind of get an idea of what the Goodwill wanted for it. And um, this one was $9.99. So I figure it, I mean, even if that's what we get at the very least, that's yeah. worth our time, I think. This is just a Madewell sweater, just standard. Yeah, that's sweater. nice. This is a sweater. There's a lot of like, a nice little sweater. Oh, these? these? So I actually picked up a couple pairs of Levi's. Okay. They're like pretty distressed. Yeah. But, and, but I feel like the distressed is like a little better. I don't know. Uh, yeah, no, I think that's the only reason I picked them up. Because they're just they were in such distress that they needed, they needed your help. Yeah. Um. No, I love selling Levi's. I feel like yeah. jeans just like this we've sold many times before. So. Oh, I don't remember. This is another one that I was gonna put back. But Wild Fable. I know it's you. A Target brand. Oh yeah. It's okay. You. But it, but it's light. It's a light, and yeah. it's not. It's not unsellable just because it's, it's a Target brand. No. It's um. I feel like it's. I will list it it's so nice. this is it's like a dress i think it's renee c i looked some stuff on some of the stuff seemed kind of like more expensive from this brand okay i've never heard of it but i didn't like find this specifically again i wasn't in the business of like sitting there and finding every exact item but it's like pretty heavy yeah um viscose viscose is good i feel like that's actually it looks kind of vintagey i don't know maybe not that but the other tag it's did i don't know tag, have to look know. Uh, anyway um yeah good stuff well, tell me I'm not done with well i know <laughs> we're just getting started oh geez uh caslon there's quite a few caslon things i don't know i asked you about them later and then didn't go back like this was kind of weird the way it was like see how it's like no it's like an asymmetrical yeah that's what i mean like yeah so i like, like that so it's a little it's a little unique yeah, well, so that's what I told him. I said, I pick up Kazlon, like, but I, pick up, I didn't pick up a single other Kazlon. You said it depends on if it's unique, but I had already picked up everything Kazlon. What do you, you like, kept it all? Yeah. I, but, yeah. But I didn't even, like... Yeah. Oh, that's okay. I, I mean, I, Kazlon's, like, so hit or miss for me. Like, I've sold it if it's in great shape and it's something that's a little bit, like I said, unique or... Um, there's just a redeeming quality about it, but I think that's actually really cute. So that's one bag down. How how am I doing so far? You're doing really well. I'm really gonna... well, and I don't even think that was the best bag by any stretch of the imagination. Really? Yeah. Let's get it. Let's look at these boots. Okay. So these boots, they're muddy. They're dirty. Or they just need to be clean. They're rubber boots. Okay. They're Henry Ferrera, made in the USA. Um. It I've never says, heard. Did you look it up? I or? looked it up. Some of them are expensive. Some of them aren't. I couldn't find any of the exact color pattern. So yeah. I don't. Know. I mean, I don't know. I don't know much about that brand, but they're cool. So these boots are Neos. Neos. Yeah, and they again have some stuff that's like more expensive. Didn't spend a whole lot of time, but they're not super heavy, so I kept them. I think they're kind of like a snow boot almost. Okay. Um, Let me see yeah. the logo. Neos. Yeah, I don't know. The tread looks in really well, good yeah, shape. Like so, um, yeah, those are kind of <clears throat> cool. Just your standard pair of, uh, whoa, what's that? How did I get bunched up? Didn't even notice that. Uh, some Tom's booties. Okay. I, we've, we've, I've picked these exact things up before and sold them just, just dandy. Okay, these are oh, Steve Madden heels. Now... I don't like. I wasn't sure. I put them in my car. Yeah. Another one that I like didn't go back and look at. I so I don't. Um, I was telling Andrew actually. Steve Madden I know has like a lot of like brands and sub brands or different labels that go for more. I don't really know the difference, so I'll have to do my own research. But they're a nice pair of like snakeskin like black pumps. Um, I I might have picked those up. You might have. All right, all right, all right. <laughs> uh, this next one is Twiggy London. It's like a jean jacket type thing. I looked this brand up, and it seemed like they were selling in like the 25-ish dollar range. Okay. So, I don't know. I think it's kind of, it's like a jean jacket, but it's, it's like, like this blue jacket. color. Yeah, it's like a jean. So it's yeah, like it's unique, like a blue jean jacket. Kind of in that way. Um, yeah, I like that. This is, a, is, this, is this a cowl neck? Is that what they call that? Yeah. Caslon. Kazlon, okay. Yeah, yeah that's like, nice. Yeah, somebody would wear that. For yeah, sure. yeah, I think so. Right. <laughs> You're going so fast. Um, I've got a lot to get through. I want to work. Yeah. 
So this is just an American Eagle t-shirt. When I picked this up, I was like, we just need inventory. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. It costs pennies, I'm sure. Um, yeah. I don't know. I don't know that I wouldn't, I would have picked, I mean, it's. You don't have to say you'd pick everything up. I don't think I'd pick this up, but like, it's kind of, it's really soft and cute. I'm trying to decide soft. if it's a, I think now, it's a women's like crop type. I don't know. Did you it's tell cute. me that BP is Nordstrom? Mm -hmm. Okay. This is a BP. Like, That's cute. Cardigan thing. Yeah, I would have. Probably. You would have picked that up. Don't lie. You would have picked it up. <laughs> oh, this is another one I couldn't find. A, I couldn't. There was stuff, but like some was more, some was less. Knox Rose. Uh, another Target. Oh, dang it. But no, it's not necessarily bad. Um, I think that's cute. It's like a little peasant dress. A um, little peasant. <laughs> I don't know where to go from there. <laughs> it matches your shirt. <laughs> it does. Um, I don't, I might have picked that up. I think it's cute. All right. This is 89th in Madison. Just a little cardigan thing. It's good. Oh, man. See, um, it didn't see that. Well, throw, Arb it, in the throw it in the garbage. <laughs> Arbenz is actually like kind of, it's, it's not dark, but it is dark. Yeah, you can't really like. <laughs> so sometimes like lighting and stuff, yeah. I can't see stains like that. That was stained. I don't know if he showed you. Yeah, I held it, I held, I held it up. That's another Caslon. Okay. Like sweater deal. Yeah, and okay, these Caslons are all like. Oh no, that's a small. It looked bigger than that. I was gonna say they're all like kind of larger sizes. That's just an oversized small, but um, I feel like sometimes that makes a difference too. So this is a Kindred Kindred Bravely Bravely. It's like a pajama top, but it's made. It's bamboo. I don't know what that like. Some of them like look them up. The some of them are expensive, I think. Okay. But it's made out of bamboo. I know I've heard of this, and I maybe have looked it up before, but I can't remember what. Um, it's somewhere. It and it's says. a two XL. Somewhere it says what they're made. What, it, what I saw like a. Oh no! I know. I was just wondering like where. Well, no, but I saw like a a, fat, a materials tag somewhere because I remember seeing and thinking like, oh, bamboo. Is it not written right there? Huh? No, I don't think so. Oh yeah, it is ninety five percent bamboo. It's really soft. Uh, rich I mean, I yeah, it's it like needs like washed and like you know not wrinkled, -y, but I think it's kind of nice. Oh, this is a like a peacoat type jacket uh, ambiance. I don't know. I think I don't remember. I think I looked it up. Yeah, I it think it. Like... Um, I don't know much about the brand, but I think I see it at like ross and stuff mm -hmm. um but it's a 1x so it has redeeming qualities and i actually think um it's in really good shape it's just like a pea coat jacket um yeah i think it has redeeming qualities i like that you like it i like it uh this is la vie it's a leather it's leather oh. i looked up comps some of them were like super expensive i actually didn't even realize that all i could see was that the so the lining is says polysand but the other materials leather i didn't mm -hmm. even see that because i was looking some up that were leather and they were pretty expensive oh so that's since cool. this one is leather maybe it is oh, so the tag i've never um lobby i'll have to put a picture on the screen of that yeah. with some of these because yeah that's cool so this next one i know this is a good brand <laughs> probably before you did uh it's a it's that. a filson hat <laughs> i mean it's pretty worn but anything filson i feel like is yeah it like it can be cleaned up. I think it can be cleaned up, and it's like a what it's do you like call it? Has it has like, like a, a dot, not dot. It has like the little like flaps that come down. Yeah, like the ear warmer yeah. flaps, yeah. like a yeah. hunter. Um, but yeah, you can smell like that leather, like it's yeah. Um, but anyway. actually, can I see that? It looks really like vintagey. Well, yeah, anything old, anything filled in this period is. It does stink. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so it needs a little work, but um, it is definitely like a vintagey type hat. I bet you knew those are very expensive. Yeah, um, I think that's kind of cool. Yeah. And yeah, when you he, this is one of the things he did tell me he found, and I was like, well, it weighs like nothing. Just throw it yeah. in, and I'll we'll look at it. Yeah. So I think that's cool. I was actually kind of excited about these. Um, these are some UGG flats, and they cool. appear to be like really good condition like the bottoms of them are like nowhere yeah those are really nice nice Ugg flats yeah i think we've gotten some well they weren't flats they were kind of like loafers but ugg loafer types 
So these are like it's tiny. But they're Hollister shorts. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> they're like like I don't know who's wearing those, but not me. <laughs> so yeah, I'll just pass those to you. <laughs> those are so small. They're pretty small. Like I mean, they're... But they're not little kids because the waist is... No, they're like, just the like waist. a junior sizing. Oh. Um, but size three is small. So, oh. I mean, you know, someone might need a pair of shorty shorts. Yeah. Uh, this is American Eagle, like, cardigan. Yeah. Uh, yeah. I'm a little selective with American Eagle, but sometimes I'll pick it up, like, because I'm, like whatever reason and it always like sells even if it sits for a little bit and we get 10 bucks out of it it seems to move so um just a nice basic cardigan in good shape <laughs> i'm excited I thought, I thought it said nordstrom when i grabbed it it definitely says norton but on the plus side it's 70 percent silk that's good right that's good it's so it's like a super vintagey yeah. tag um it's like i don't know really old school like blouse it's not the worst thing i've ever seen i don't know anything about this brand it's norton mcnaughton yeah um but i think that's hilarious yeah. <laughs> um, we'll have to look that one up so these jeans i was pretty excited about yeah they're page jeans mm -hmm. like, and the everything looks the good. infamous stretching that happens in the crotch of page jeans is not there. It's not there. It's in good shape. So that's, that's like that's just a solid pair of page jeans. They're in actually really good you shape. Can't, can't be mad about those. No. Uh, this is a Chico's jean jacket. Okay. Like orange jean jacket. I like the prompts. I like. I feel like little, that'll. Sell. I like selling Chico's. I know a lot yeah. of people resellers I've seen like well, love picking up Chico's. Well, yeah, because so that thing I told you I saw the other day. I can't remember who's either Instagram or YouTube, I saw it on, otherwise I'd give you a shout out, <laughs> but, um, it was, like, brands with a cult following, and Chico's was actually on yeah, there, it was, like, I one think, of them, yeah, and I, I can't remember who it was, it was somebody on we've Instagram, we've sold it, and, um, as long as it has a size, because sometimes Chico's tags, I feel like they're ripped out, but that is kind of a cool little jean jacket, I like that, uh, this is another thing, I think I looked it up, it's kind of unique, that's why I kept it, it's, like, that asymmetrical, it's Ashley, I don't know, I looked it up, and I think there was some, like, Ashley, I don't know. Um, just that's a cute little like jacket though. Yeah. I don't know. We'll have to do our research. Okay. And just when you thought there was only one pair of page jeans, boom, found another one right next to them. Mm -hmm. And everything looks good. Awesome. It's exciting. I'm so Two excited. bags in. How am I doing? You're doing really well. Like, would you send me back by myself at this point? I'm going to send you back. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed yourself. Um, it was it was good. It, I, I enjoyed you were it. stressed. No, I'm not. So the biggest <laughs> thing is, so we live in Oregon. You're still required to wear a mask when you go into places, and my throat's just on fire from spending time in there. <laughs> yeah. Um, but that's supposed to be ending soon, so yeah, maybe it'll go back when it's done. But anyway, um, here's some Nike uh, flats. I think I sold those exactly. Yeah, I was gonna say. I well, some seen, that were really clean. similar. Like they're they're super dirty, they're easy but they clean. just they're it's all like rubbish material. Nike slides, like I feel yeah. like people people love them. So these are new. Bellini, I look like I think I looked Can them I up, it? and there I... was a decent amount. Like they're yeah, they're new. They're they have new. like that's cool. So I, so I kept them. Um, yeah, they're, I mean, they're just like a cute pair of like, oh my gosh, those are tall. I can't imagine. Um, like, well, they're not wedges, but like summer heels. Those are cool. Okay. Now, maybe I, you have her. I saw those in your, um, Andrew sent me a picture of like his card at one point. Show me how full it was. I saw them and I was like, I can't wait to hear what those are because well, okay, I have so no idea. Maybe, maybe I haven't heard this brand. Maybe I have. I thought I did when I saw it. Fry, F R Y E. Yeah. See, I knew they were good. <laughs> I did because I, I looked them up. I saw it. And I was like, wait. You, I, I like would have familiar. been really excited to pick those up. And I looked them up, and Easy these, one. like, I think they'll clean up okay. But like, new ones were very expensive. Those are really great. I don't think I would turn down a pair of fries. Boom! Um, Shock. I don't know what like these tennis shoe type. Because there are a lot of things I looked up were like boots. So these are, so the yeah, style is on picked here. Up boots. It's called like Moto something. Those are No, Biker cool. High Top. Kira Biker High see. Top. Yeah. I... So, I mean, they're pretty, like they're worn, but. Well, yeah, but I mean, Somebody I kind of think. Them. Somebody will enjoy them. 
I also think boots like this kind of come with like a worn finish. So I don't know how worn they actually are. I think they're really cool though. And I would have definitely been excited maybe about those. I, I thought maybe I didn't look these up. Oh, Zara, these are Zara. Oh, okay. Yeah, those that's, are cool. that's why. They, yeah. So there's some blue heels. What does that say? Oh, yeah, Zara. Cool. So this is a rugby shirt. I wasn't, it was a, another one of those when I was in the moment of like, there's not a lot here. So yeah. I stuff my heart. I, and there's a couple other shirts that I found later of this same brand that I didn't pick up. Um, but I don't know. It's just a. Did you, like you a, say you didn't look it up? No, I no, did. You did. And there's a bunch of different styles and this is like a, supposed to be like a regular shirt. There's other ones and I didn't throw the other ones in the cart, but I didn't want to dig through to like pull that one out. Cause it's, it's like at the bottom. I feel like sometimes super like Stuff niche like that, things yeah. like that, they'll sell and it's an XL. Um, that's kind of cool. This is another another one that was like at the beginning. So yeah, we're hitting another pocket of that. Okay. Um, it's Alfani. <laughs> I don't know. It's just a, it's um, pretty light. I have, I have a hard time moving it. I can't, but it's... um. Okay. I think a men's, like a men's pullover. That's, that's not bad. I like it. So this is the first item I grabbed that I was like, okay. You found your stride. But this this is this is some money right here. Okay. I don't think they're in the best condition. Well, I don't really remember because I just remember seeing the brands like, okay, <laughs> we've sold some of these before that are that have sold for a lot. Yeah, they're Ariat. Oh, perfect. Oh, that's right. There, there's like some like the yeah the crotch is kind of worn more than I thought, but still no holes. Mm. But either way, they're like work jeans. Like people use them as like work mm -hmm. jeans and stuff. So, so yeah, I remember thinking like, okay, maybe, but they're like, yeah, they're men's. Yeah. Um, but anyway, I think yeah, somebody will that's still buy cool. those. Yeah. That was the first item that I grabbed. And they were in one of those random, just like hard goods bins. Yeah, Andrew said there was a bunch of just like pockets of clothes or shoes. Just Yeah, it was the weirdest thing. Like it's been Not a, in a clothes or shoes. There bin. weren't very many clothes bins. Like there was literally like on the perimeter, there was clothes. Other than that, it was all hard goods. That's so sad. I haven't been in like maybe a couple months now and it was mostly clothes. It's always, for, every time I've ever gone, it's all always the time. clothes. Yeah. So that's why, yeah, I mentioned earlier, like on my way back, if that's something that happens, like maybe because it's the beginning of the month, maybe the time of the week, because we usually wouldn't go on a Tuesday. I went on Thursdays, though. Yeah. But yeah, it was weird. I got there and everything in the mid everything was hard goods with mm. a few soft. And well, then I all the ones it. that were clothes, like there'd be like piles of like bedding and then a few clothes underneath, kind of how you see anyway mm -hmm. sometimes. Yeah, it was, huh. it was well, weird. Well, I hope it goes back to clothes. I'm sure it will. It's probably yeah. just probably trying to clear stuff out. Yeah. Um, uh, these are some boot cut Levi's. Yeah. Kind of unique. That's has that little cool. flower They're... thing. I don't know. What's the style? 515 boot cut. Mm. I don't know my style super well, but I, don't know style um, really well. I know that some go for more than others, but I think they, they always move no matter what. I think people seek out Levi's, so those are cool. I don't, I don't know about these. These are Nike. Like they're, I think they're kind of like a swim bottom. Yeah, like kind of board yeah, shorts. Like board, yeah, board shorts. They're not in like the bed. Eh, they're, they're decent. They're in okay shape. You'd pick them up. <laughs> um, well, it's, it's like a skort. Oh, what is in this pocket? Okay, here's what I, I like know. about this. Hold on, let's go back. I might, I would have picked this up because it's like a skort bottom and it kind of looks really like 90s. Um, it does have like a swimsuit bottom instead of shorts, but I think that's really cool actually. So there's quite a bit of swimming stuff and I don't know swimsuit brands at all, but I know going it's... in the summer, like, I don't know. I'm yeah. sure if there's good brands, like there's another swimming piece in here that I think will be good, but... okay. Um, and there are some of these running shorts. I couldn't tell if they were kids or not. I don't think these are because they're a size extra small. They're just running. Yeah, shorts. those look like just women. But there's something in the pocket there that you need to empty out before them. What is it? I don't know. It's uh, like a clean exercise. Oh, okay. <laughs> so, <laughs> I thought you like I'm knew what it was and you didn't want to uh, say. <laughs> no. Oh, so yeah, this is the other. This is a Nike swimming suit. Yeah. Piece. I feel like that's got it like sell right. Here's what I like about some of these pieces. It's gonna like take two it? seconds to photograph. And it weighs nothing. Well, I keep that in mind. I do too. I don't know if other resellers do, but yeah. I'm like, okay, that like, again, takes no time to photograph. So I would have definitely, I would have picked it up. It's a good shape, a good shape, little one piece. So I got quite a few like Victoria's Secret bras. Okay. Like we've sold them before. They were all kind of bunched together. So I figured why not? Yeah. Um, as long as like the clasps work and they're in good shape, which this one appears to be. 
Um, I think a lot of it depends on the size. Like, I think people seek out whatever size they are, obviously. And... I don't know why they seek out the other size. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> um, I, I, yeah, so I, we've sold them. Some sit for a while, some move really quick. But again, easy to photograph. <laughs> okay, this is one where you can't make fun of me if it's not good because I grab somebody, like, a worker grabbed somebody's cart and was like, whose cart is this? And threw all the stuff back in a bin. Oh, yeah, I would have totally jumped on so, that. <laughs> yeah, I guess I did. Um, and these were one of them, and I was going to look them up, and then they got buried. So um, Can Can is a good good jean brand. It's a good jean brand. Yeah. Okay, I was worried. I almost I, threw them back. I sometimes don't if they're, like, overly worn. These do not appear worn. What size are they? What are they called? Can Can. Can Can. Um, oh, they're size, like, 30s. So it's a good size, um, just a pair of distressed jeans, and I think those are awesome. I would have kept those. You kept them. All yeah. right, all right, all right. This is a Volcom like, dress thing. I don't know. It was light. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah, I mean, Volcom... Sometimes you're just throwing stuff in your cart, and you're like, eh, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's just a Volcom, like, summer dress. It's pretty tiny, but it's cute. It's really soft. Okay, this next piece was one of those where... I saw okay. this in your cart, too, and I was like, what is that? <laughs> well, okay, so you mentioned some people won't pick them up if they haven't sold at the Goodwill. Okay. Well, sometimes the Goodwill, at least arguably, will has things priced ridiculous amounts. Most of the and time. And this is priced really high. So I oh, thought... Oh, okay, maybe, so yeah. So I thought, okay, oh, maybe. It's, so at the Goodwill, they wanted twenty four ninety nine for it. So it's G by Julie... G, I don't know. Juliana. 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 I don't know. It's like a... It's like a leather. Is it leather? I, well, I don't know. I guess I should have looked. Uh, I think I looked, actually, if I remember right. Shell, polyurethane, backing, uh, polyester, 20% rayon, spandex. No, there's no real leather. Weird, though, because you can take you can, like, these off. That, That's interesting. Yeah, so. I mean, I don't know anything about that brand. There was another one I found later. The I jacket is unique enough that I think it could be a cool pickup. Could be cool. Could be cool. All right, three three bags down, one more to go. This is exciting. All right, this I wish there was more. <laughs> I know, right? This is another pair of Steve Madden heels. Not as good a shape as I thought. Again, I'm gonna I'm gonna blame it on the lighting and the bends. Uh, so there's some scuffs fair. there, some scuffs around there, which tells me they probably aren't made super well. I don't know. Yeah, they look a lot like the other ones, just red. Um, they're just a red pair of pumps. Um, um I don't know. They might be able to be cleaned up. Maybe. Indigo? Is Indigo anything? I don't know. Fred Meyer? Well, uh, Fred well, Meyer's is in... Um, yeah, it's in Oregon. Yeah, one yeah, yeah it's not Nebraska. nationwide, but I think it's a brand they sell. Uh, I used to have boots that look just this like that. Babies. They're cute, though. Um, and they're in really good shape, so I don't see why those wouldn't sell. I don't know much about the brand. But. All right, this is a vintage looking... Columbia jacket, but, oh, wow. oh. um, it's just needs a little cleanup, but definitely is like I think an older style. Um, but yeah. that's cool. You should turn it around. It's a is it men's, men's large, which is great. Um, yeah, it's like a pretty heavy duty coat actually, and it's yeah, that's cool. And it is I think vintagey. I'll have to look it up, but that's cool. Um, covering up. Yeah, these you might not be happy about. <laughs> what They're are they? just Air Postal cargo shorts. <laughs> I don't know. I mean, you can be honest. You can. You can okay, be... it's I. I don't you know that I would have picked them up. Them up okay, but okay. I'm not. A, I'm not opposed to listing them. Is the thing. And well, we're gonna list it all, <laughs> except for the thing you threw over there. Well, it's got a stain. So. Yeah, we'll see. Um, yeah, like it's not. Uh, I know you hate when I do that. I'm sorry. <laughs> I, do. I really do. Just, I just. I do not like that at all. <laughs> Um, bin set. We'll wash all these clothes. Well, yeah. But like, just the bins. Fly, <laughs> the bins air. The bins um, these are Aeropostal. Um, hey, well, what did you call it? Aeropostal. 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 I think I'm saying it right. I think I'm saying it right. <laughs> Vote in the comments Vote below. In the comments. Air. I, don't, I, don't, I, don't, I, I forgot how I was saying it. Oh yeah. Aeropostal. It must not be right. Aeropostal. We'll see. We'll I can't. See. I want to know. Okay. <laughs> yeah. No, we'll list those. Uh, was Claiborne blazer type thing? I don't know. I don't, I don't know. know. Getting down to the nitty gritty. Getting here. down to the nitty gritty. I don't know. Um, I don't usually pick up Liz Claiborne, but it's not 
unlistable again. It's a nice like gray blazer. Oh, this is a Torrid bra. Okay. I grabbed that because I know. Torrid, I feel like also has like a I don't know if cult following is the right word, but a Torrid sells pretty well for us. Another Victoria's um, Secret one. I think that's all the bras actually. So I guess just two Victoria's Secret and one Torrid. That's okay. Those are great. Um, was a little stained. I can't in the tell. Armpit. Oh yeah, I noticed that after. Ooh. I think. See, I think these might be boys. Actually, they're Nike. Nike. Yeah, but you sold Nike like boy stuff like this. They just sit a little longer, but um, yeah, those definitely aren't men's because those wouldn't fit me. <laughs> the other largest. Yeah, <laughs> yeah those are kind of small. Um, but they're cool. That I've sold kids Nikes before. Oh, just some Vans shorts. Is it nice? I would have picked them up probably. You picked those up. I know. <laughs> you know. Oh, I see some stains. I know. I don't even know. Oh, this is a Carhartt. That's that Carhartt vest thing I was telling you about. So I think that stain though will come out in the wash. What it right here? I just worry it's bleach. Oh, yep, that's probably bleach, huh? Mm-hmm. Dang. Darn the Vins lighting. Darn the Vins lighting. <laughs> Curse you Vins lighting. Yeah. I mean someone actually still might buy somebody it. Would. Yeah, I can um see it's a Carhartt women's xl vest so it's and it's it's not like super bleached yeah I don't another know. so another carhartt xl shirt it's a little warm but it's a big carhartt we've sold shirt. carhartt just yeah. plain t-shirts yeah. it's carhartt's definitely a great brand um oh there's one more victoria's secret bra i think that's good that's gotta be yeah um oh and then some uh under Armour compression short things. Yeah. There's a... Mm, might be underwear. No, not really underwear. underwear. I would not wear those as underwear. Well, I guess. I don't know. I don't know what they are, but we'll sell them. They're in, like, brand new condition. And last, but certainly not least, a pair of Lucky Brand jeans. Nice. What, uh... They are sized, oh, they are sweet and straight. Oh, I think I've sold those before. Not this pair, though. No, well, it could have been. Yeah, but nobody threw them in the bins already. No, that's true. They, they're still wearing them. All right. What do I get? What What's what's my uh, grade on the day? Oh, I didn't. <laughs> that just, like, put me on the spot a little bit. Yeah. Um, you get an... A minus. A minus? Why the minus? Because there's just a few things yeah, I wouldn't have picked up. pretty hard to like. It's yeah. Like, and I guess when I go, I'd probably give myself an A minus most of the time, too. <laughs> I mean, I, yeah. But, but like, how much, like, yeah, It's know. all, uh, like, I feel like it's all worth picking up, for sure. Really? That good, huh? Yeah. Because I was worried, like, some of the stuff I was like, I don't know, like, I wasn't worried, per se, because, like, I like paying pennies for a lot of it, but... Yeah, well, and I think our circumstances, again, are a little different. We've mentioned how, um, like, we have a baby on the way, so we're going to have, like, that newborn yeah. time where probably neither of us is going to have time to source, so we're really trying to pack yeah, up our pack inventory. Up inventory. We should get a storage unit and just start packing it full. <laughs> I feel like we... I don't know what you call this. Uh -huh. <laughs> like, um, so... With that in mind, I definitely think just keeping our stores alive and keeping listing going, um, I think it's great. And I'm going to send you back. What's your favorite item? Oh. Oh, this is so hard because I always forget a lot of the stuff. Well, just what comes to mind first. Um, I like the fries. The fries are your favorite? I like the fries. Really? I like that they're unique. Really? Of all the things, What's the your fries? favorite? I am between. I really like those UGG flats just because they're. Oh, like those are good. But I also really like the page jeans find. Oh yeah. Kind of the page jeans, two pairs, just back to back, just boom, boom. Mm -hmm. Um, I, but the Ariat though, they hold a special place, even though they're not <laughs> like as in good a condition as I thought, because that was when like the tables turned when it was just. Like, it was a, right. an emotional. Because as I mentioned before, I was, I was a little <laughs> discouraged. Um, I was just like, "What the heck? My first time here by myself, and there's all these stupid hard goods like." No offense if you sell hard goods, but... It's just we not just, our... Yeah, we don't know not, much about it. Yeah, it's just not something that we've gotten really into. Um, so I was just like, what the heck? Like, because it's a long drive. And yeah. I took, like, it, it was kind of like on a whim. Like, I still have to go 
uh, I have some other stuff that I need to get done today. So um, yeah. kind of like just up and decide, okay, I'm going to go real quick. I have time. Um, I mean, you haven't been to the bench for like... It's been a long time. Since almost a bench. year? Over oh, a year? Oh, it hasn't been that long. We haven't been it's going been to the bench really for a time. year. You start going to the bench like the summer. I've been going by my... Well, without Andrew for a really long time, though. Um, sometimes with a friend, sometimes by myself. But um, I knew you hadn't been there in a while. I haven't been there. So... <laughs> so... It was good though. It was. Uh, I'll, I'll definitely go back. Like I was actually kind of itching to go to the bend after bend. <laughs> I know. I, was like, I feel like I kind of like found my groove, which according to you seems like maybe you I did. did. We'll see. We should keep track. Let's keep track of this so we can see how much money we make off of it. What you don't want to? Because that's <laughs> no. a lot more work. Huh? No, it doesn't. It's not more work. I it's just start to. Work. It, I just start to forget where things came from because it's okay if it's loosely tracked. Yeah. Okay. I can loosely track it. Uh, I can't make any promises. Sarah lists all the items. I at this point am doing like pretty much all the pictures. Mm -hmm. um, you'll get a couple here and there. I do a good chunk of the shipping. Every now and again, you'll do shipping. Mm -hmm. um, but Sarah does all of the listing. I haven't yeah. listed items for a while. I also like. I was listening when we were using the computer more mm -hmm. to list, but now you do it all from your phone. And I also don't want to like log in and out of Facebook because it's on your yeah. account. Yeah, it. We've that. actually, I mean, everything aside, like we've found a pretty good rhythm. Like yeah. with Andrew photographing, you know, a certain amount so that I can list every day and make sure we're getting listings up. And then yeah, I, and then I'm able to list when I can when I have time and yeah. throughout the day. So it's worked pretty well. Yeah. Pretty well. So. Yeah, but good job. Thanks. High five. <laughs> High five. <laughs> You're so awkward. <laughs> <laughs> you made that awkward. Whatever. All right, you guys. If you enjoyed the video, please hit that like and subscribe button. We really appreciate you tuning in. Hopefully, you enjoyed seeing our haul. Hopefully, you think I did well. Hey, drop a comment. How did I do? Would yeah. you have picked up some of these items? Would you have not? Let us know. For now, Andrew and Sarah, out. out.